So it's five past seven. Um, I got up early so I can get in my workout before we have to go to my parents' place because we're going to their place for um, Christmas. Um, my eyes are a bit puffy um, because I kind of cried myself to sleep last night. I got it on the scale again yesterday and it went up by a lot. Um, which my husband also said is not technically it wasn't like a permanent weight shift more like uh, maybe you have a, a water weight shift or something like that but obviously you're gonna freak out about it anyway so um, I just got the, on the scale again and it went down considerably um, so I'm happy about that, but I'm going to have to spend my day walking around with puffy eyes. So, let's do this. Okay, so I'm now going to start doing my workout. What I forgot to mention earlier was, as I was crying myself to sleep, um... I just thought about binging the whole time. I was like, maybe I I just give up. I'm gonna like eat a lot of bread and my whole peanut stash and everything like that. Um, but I'm glad I didn't because the weight, the the scale looks a bit better today. And unfortunately, um, as someone with an eating disorder, the the scale really does dictate my life. But anyway, I'm going to start doing my workout. got my mat here. Um, and I'm going to be doing one half hour of Pilates and one half hour of yoga. And then I'm going to do about 20 um, minutes of stretching. Um, make myself a bit more flexible and also interesting story behind that was when I was younger when I was in primary school um, I was I guess like the second biggest girl in the grade so I was overweight especially for my age and all the beautiful um, popular girls did gymnastics and they were super flexible so they were super skinny and just beautiful and gorgeous and then there was me, the living land whale. So I said to myself, um, one day when I get down to, one day when I'm skinny, I'm going to be able to do what they were be able to do. So I'm halfway there, um, not that quite there with the middle split, but the side splits, I'm getting really close. And I'm more flexible and I am just really happy about that so hard work is paying off also i'm not going to be showing my workout i'm a bit self-conscious about it but someday i promise i'm gonna show you guys my full workout routine so i just finished my bath and now it's time to get ready Presents, presents, presents. Which one do you think is Mason's? I'll give you a clue. Both. Both of them are Mason's. So now we are on our way to my parents' house and taking along Seven, trusty little Doxy, and my husband. Say hi. Hi. 
and we're just going to get something to drink and then we're on our way to my parents house and giving Mason all her cute little gifts Hello, Dada. Hello. 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 I went back home so I did not vlog the food because I'm very new to vlogging and putting my phone in all the food is going to be a bit embarrassing at the moment um, I might feel more comfortable doing 
that in the future anyway so I had some small little mini pastries I had a lot of them um, they were delicious I had some fried chicken and some gammon which is pork and now we are going to take a nap and um, we had like this Christmas we don't really have a Christmas dinner we normally have a Christmas lunch um, so it's about four right now and we are tired and we are going to take a nap because our daughter is with my grand with my mom with grannies and mommy and daddy get to go to sleep so I hope you guys had a real great time I hope you guys are not melting like we are because it's summer in the south and it's unbearable so all you guys with snow hope you had a fun time and Merry Christmas and Happy New Year